What's going on, everybody? Hopefully, everybody stayed pretty warm. I know the storms are still coming through. I was out there today shoveling out some snow. Back's a little sore from doing some manual labor, finally. Had a dog out there with me. So if you hear her snoring underneath me, I tried to move her. She just keeps coming back. So I do apologize. If you guys ever had a pug or know somebody has a pug, yeah, that's the snoring noise way underneath the desk. And I just am not winning with it today at all. But back to the matter at hand. Um, this video is going to go into self-admittal to shilling on somebody's own, you know, card auction onto eBay. And he did this on social media. And even if you do it as a joke, you, you, you don't do that. I just don't even know how to even say it. Don't do that. You're even joking around because now there's stuff floating around out there. And even if it was a joke, you're going to be held accountable for that statement. I don't know how you really make that right, to be honest. And I, had, I did some research onto it, and like I said, you guys might be getting two or three videos a day, so I do apologize on it, but there's a lot of stuff coming through my box that I'm verifying, and due to time restraints on, like, eBay side of the house with auctions and that, I want to get stuff out. At the same time frame, uh, thank you, everybody, for subscribing, too. I, I didn't say that in the beginning, probably because it's my third time doing the video, because I'm a little bit... uh. I don't know, feeling, I don't want to say sick because the people are going to be like your COVID, but being outside all day with the snow all morning, you kind of have like that dry throat and stuff going on. So I was trying to clear up my voice a little bit more and better for the videos. But thank you for subscribing. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button. The giveaway is supposed to be here tomorrow, but with the weather, I don't know. So that's why you might get three videos um, for Wednesday. Wait, yeah, Wednesday, which is tomorrow, today for the video type deal. But uh, just be on the lookout for the videos as they pop up. And I'll, I'll try to keep everybody informed as the giveaway video is up as well, too. But it should be here there tomorrow, but no later than Thursday, I'm guessing. But let's get back to the matter at hand here real quick on to it all. So I don't want to go long on to this. So, like I said, story is, guy said he was going to shill bit his own cards up off another account. So I did some digging in today, probably about a good hour, hour and a half worth, because you got to do that when you do these things. So let's pull up the eBay page. Bing, there we go. So you guys can see right there, that's the lot. Oops, there we go, this screen. Right there. It exceeds up to fourteen nine. It's gone up, I think, uh, just under $1,000 since I started looking at it. So it ends tomorrow. Uh, guys, 99.4% feedback. There's his name, Gregory Dean, 1984. And you can see with the highlights, I've been going through stuff, looking at and everything. So, I'm going to put that up. Let me get this, the picture up. So, this is the message, you know, from there. And I tried to cut and splice this out. This, I did not get this message. This was emailed to me that way, so I couldn't just, like, take this out and do a picture. But if you match them up, you could tell it's the same person onto it. Uh, just hard to do off of this. I do apologize. When I did like cut it out and try to expand it, it got blurry. But it, it's it's the same one. You can tell just by looking at this. Look at the colors and the pictures and stuff like that, the cards. Well, anyhow, I don't know who started this post. There's two Gregs on here. But Greg Compton says, I am going to bid it up with my other account if I don't get what I want. Don't ever make that statement, even joking and put it on social media. My goodness. Even if you were joking, which I'm sure now, to, you know, somebody will say something. You'd be like, oh, I was just joking on it. Don't matter. You put that statement out there. People are going to come to their own conclusions onto this. So I, I did a little bit of digging onto this. And I'm going to pull the picture, the picture, picture down. There it is. There we go. All right. So I went into the bids. There are a lot of bids onto this, and I try to narrow it down. I mean, when you go through this whole thing here, I mean, look, 13 feedback, 15 feedback, 21 feedback. The one that sticks out to me the most is the 21 feedback with the 5 that ends in C here. Because you'll see it as you come up. Oh, actually, I think it backs this one here. 5 with a 4 onto it. 5, 4. And then you come up here, high bidder is 5, 4. Without me really even pricing all those out, I have no idea what the guy's trying to get for it and what they're worth. Uh, that That's just a crazy lot, to be honest. But, I mean, could it be the guy at the 7? No idea. When I pulled the 21 up, 100% activity, could it possibly be this one? Maybe. If he actually is doing it, it's 
not the so-called in quotation marks joke. Could it have been? Oops, I clicked that. The uh, this guy here, the seven. Come on. Shouldn't be watching this on the other screen. 17% feedback, no retractions. I guess we're probably really not going to know until if we see him as a high bidder and he retracts it, then it could kind of go back. Or unless somebody knows who his other handle is and we could try to match it up. I, I don't know. I'm more about the statement being made on social media platform, even if it's as a joke or not. To me, I, would, I didn't take it as a joke because I didn't see no ha-ha, LOL, or any of those other weird emojis and stuff out there, you know. Hey, you look at it, there, there's a lot of crazy low bids on this. But like I said, I know people would have low numbers. They only buy bigger stuff on eBay. So anything's possible anymore. But I really couldn't figure it out too much, you know, which one would basically point back to him right off the bat on to here. All right, back to item description. So... When you the uh, when you look here, oops, let me scroll down. It says the seller's from Royal City, uh, Royal City. Oh boy, Royal Center, Indiana. Well, when I found some other stuff, it said he was in like Culver, Indiana, and Salt something, Indiana. And I can tell you, they're like on well, forty minutes, like the high point of drive A to B on to it off a of map quest. So I'm like, well, could be. Start digging some more in. And I learned that Gregory Compton's middle name is Dean. So there's Gregory Dean. I also learned that his birth the year is 1984. So that all makes sense to me offhand. So matching it off, plus with the statement and everything, you know, you never know. Somebody could be trying to go out there and get at somebody for the wrong reason. It all matched up. It all matched up. I would pull it up, but that stuff there. But there's a lot of other PI on there that I don't want to put out to, you know, the public on to it when I was digging. But anybody can go out there and find it. it. It's not hard. It's just I don't want to put that stuff on there for right now. Uh, but it all matched up. So, I mean, honestly, what do you guys think offhand with it? I mean, with both things, do you think he's already started doing shill bidding on his own cards? And what do you think about making a, a remark like that on social media? My opinion offhand is I can't tell enough if it, one of those other accounts are his to shill bid. Could it be? Yeah. Yeah, I'd probably say 80% chance. Yeah, that could be hit one of his. But the other point that I get at, you don't make a comment like that on social media and ruin your reputation over it. That's just not good. And that's not even a private message. That might have been on his Facebook page or in a group he's in. I, I, can't, I don't know. I didn't really dig into it all. But... It brings to a good point that people are really, I guess you'd say, were ballsy to say something like that because in a lot of places that I've, you know, been into with chat rooms, Facebook groups, and stuff like that, you don't make jokes like that. Never, ever, ever, ever. Oh, wow. I just, you know, there's always that key thing. It's like, oh, man, I didn't know you had that on eBay. I'm going to go hit that up. And when they say it, it's because they wanted the card. They didn't know that you had you were had it up for sale, and you had no idea they had interest in it. Totally different thing. But this guy here, be wary. And if you're one of the bidders onto that, be wary too. Um, I, I don't know. I mean, that's a lot of money for that to begin with. Guy said he if he doesn't get what he wants, or he doesn't get up there. He's going to start doing his own stuff. And again, the exact words out of this was. I'm going to bid it up with my other account if I don't get what I want. Interesting. Very, very interesting on to it because it looks like, I think in this picture, it wasn't even $100 yet or something like that. Which you have to know over time, eBay is going to take a little bit for people to start bidding on and, you know, look at it. Plus, that's a good bit of money. But, you know, shame on you, man, for even making that kind of comment out there. But I, I just want to see what everybody else's opinion is on to that. What do you think offhand? I mean, I wouldn't make a comment like that offhand, but I, I, I don't see how I could really link shill bidding to it. But if you're in on this thing, because I do know some people that watch these videos do spend some money, I, I would pull out of it. I would not feel comfortable myself. I would not at all. But that's pretty much it, everybody. I'm hitting 10 minutes. 
I do appreciate you guys taking time to watch this uh, with the with all the stuff going on out there and taking time to watch the videos that I produce out here. I know they're going a lot of different ways from, you know, I haven't done a whole lot of like real good videos, like the good part of the hobby, because every time I turn around, I'm getting stuff, you know, it's negative into the hobby itself and stuff that I really think that people should be aware of and, uh, you know, stare clear of. Even if you didn't know it was going on and you're new to this, it just gives you a different perspective completely onto it. But everybody take care this week. I know we will be going live eventually to do the giveaway. I just don't know when, so keep an eye out on that video as well too, everybody. Stay safe this week out there from the weather, and I will catch you all later.